Hi guys, so we're gonna be packing today. I'm gonna show you guys how I pack my toiletry bag and also my makeup bag and yes, I'm in my PJs because that's what we're all doing today. Um, we're just gonna be packing, packing, packing and we're gonna film for you guys. So yeah, I have the little guy here. Oh, he's so sweet. Um, yeah, let's just get started. I'm gonna show you guys how I pack all of this right here. Okay, so I have everything laid out on my vanity. I'll zoom you guys in. So over here I have all of the makeup and also this pixie pouch I got from a PR gift. And that is where my makeup brushes are gonna go. And then over here are all of the toiletries that I'm bringing. And this is the makeup toiletry bag. Um, so all the toiletries are going to go in here, and then this is where my makeup is going to go. So as you can see, this one's from Pixie, and if you hear noises, do you see the little boy? There he is! <laughs> so anyways, this is from Pixie. I got it from a PR package, and then this one is from Amazon. And this is actually... TSA approved you guys, so I'll link it below. It's great if you want to put liquids in it. You definitely can. Um, but yeah, all my makeup is going to fit in here. So let's just go ahead and get packing. Like I said, everything is right here. I think this is everything I need. I feel like I'm missing something, but we will see. Alright you guys, so you're going to be hearing a lot of noises. I apologize for that, but my son is playing and if I take it away, he will just cry or I can't put him in the other room. So yeah, he has to be in here. <laughs> right, yeah. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and start packing the makeup. Everything is going to fit in this little bag. Again, this is from Amazon. I love that it opens like this. Um, and yeah, this is TSA approved. It's it's amazing. So definitely check this out. It was only eight dollars, I think. And I love how it's clear too. Okay, so the first thing is my face primer and also moisturizer. This is from Pixie. It's a rose flash balm. It's really really good, you guys. Highly recommend it. This is my second tube. I had to get another one. It's just so good. I love this. And then for foundation, I'm bringing this one from Givenchy. It's the Photo Perfection foundation, and it has SPF 20. I'm in the color... Baby! I'm in the color Perfect Honey. I love this foundation because it gives me just enough coverage for every day. And it looks really good, so that's that one. My concealer is from Jouer. I love this concealer. It's like the best, you guys. Highly recommend. I have the Charlotte Tilbury Unisex Healthy Glow. This is a tint moisturizer. So if I do get darker, this is going to be my little foundation concoction, I guess. I'm going to mix this with my foundation and we're, we should be good to go. Um, and then I do have face powders right here. This one from Essence is super cheap. I highly recommend it. I love this for my under eyes. And then this one's for all over the face. It's from It Cosmetics and it has SPF 50. They're actually discontinuing this, which makes me really, really sad. They reformulated it without the SPF. So yeah, but if you can get your hands on the one with the SPF 50, you'll love it. I'm obsessed. I love this. Like, seriously, you guys, I've hit pan. Oh my goodness. This is my second one, actually. So... Yeah, I've been using this ever since I got pregnant with Liam, so almost two years, you know? Like, it's so good. Seriously, this is so good. Okay, and then I have two palettes here. One is from Dior. This has highlights and a blush, and seriously, I just mix it all together, and it looks so good on your skin. I love this. I really don't go anywhere without this little palette. And then I have the Charlotte Tilbury, what is this, Instant Look in a Palette. This one is the Seductive Beauty. I love this. So you have your eyeshadows, um, bronzer, blushes, and highlight. It's so good. So this is the palette I'm taking with me. It's just so compact and it has everything that I need. And it just fits right there. And Okay, I have this mini palette. I'm not sure if I'm going to be bringing this yet. I mean, I don't need it, but it's just beautiful. So it's from the... So it's from Natasha Denona. It's the mini nude palette, but like, look at those colors. 
I don't know. I might not bring this because, again, I don't need it, but it's just so beautiful. So that's that. I have brow products here. This one's the Hourglass Arch Fiber Gel in Warm Brunette to set my brows. Um, and then I have these pencils from NARS. I have them in two shades, but they both work for me. Medium brown, warm, and medium brown cool. One is almost gone, so that's why I have two with me. Um, let's see, I have the Hourglass Waterproof Liquid Liner, so in case I want to do a little wing, which is very rare, but just in case. I have this one. This is a cream shadow crayon from Jouer in the color Rose Gold. It's so pretty, you guys. Like, look at that. It's so pretty. So I'm bringing that. I like to just kind of... I don't know, smear that all over my eyes. <laughs> it's like super quick. Um, this is my Givenchy Base Perfecto Mascara Primer. I don't go anywhere without this. I love that. That's like my third tube, I think. And then this is the mascara that I'm bringing. And I've been using this and I love it. Um, it's the Charlotte Tilbury Full Fat Lashes Mascara. The wand on this is beautiful and it gives my lashes enough length and volume without clumping it up. I love this. And my lashes feel really light too. Like it feels like it doesn't even have a mascara when you touch it. It's so good. So I love this. Um, and then I have the Charlotte Tilbury Eye Pencil. This is just like a dark brown. Amber Moon is the color. And yeah, I need to sharpen this. But yeah, this is like my favorite pencil. Look, look how tiny it is. <laughs> and then I have three lip products here. This one's from Sugar. Um, I mean from Fresh. It's the Sugar Rose. It's a tinted lip balm. It's so tiny. But I love this. So that's that. And then I have a Dior lipstick in the color 578. It's just like a... Uh, a sheer kind of pink lipstick. It's really nice. I love that shade. And then I have a nude. This is my favorite from Hourglass. It's the color Idealist. And you can see I've been using this like for forever. Like I love this nude. Kind of like an orangey nude. It's really good. I love it. So those are the lippies that I have. I have uh, a few more in my my purse but that's what's going to be in my makeup bag, and I'm telling you guys, I swear it fits. <laughs> it all fits in here. Let me just put them all in there. So everything just kind of stacks here in the top area. So yeah, I'm not sure if I'm going to be bringing this mini palette, but I mean, I definitely can if I want to. Um, you can fit so much in this little makeup bag. Look at that. And I love how it's see-through. And yeah, again, it's TSA approved. So definitely check this out. So that's my makeup and my makeup brushes. Okay, you guys, on to the toiletries. Again, this is from Pixie. I love this. I got one from Benefit a long time ago, but it was so worn out. I had to, you know, get rid of it and switch on to something new. Um, so yeah, this is the one that I've been using now, and I love it. Again, it's from Pixie. I'm not sure if they're selling it. I got this from my PR package, but if I can find it, I will definitely link it below. So anyways, there's a compartment here on the top, and you can definitely hang this up once you get to your destination. Um, two compartments here. I just, I love this. So anyways, I'm going to go ahead and put all the big liquid stuff in this area, and then everything that's not liquid goes in here. So let's just go ahead and do that. So I have my Garnier Whole Blends. Um, gentle Detangling Milk. I've talked about this in a video. I absolutely love this. This is my second bottle and it's almost gone. So actually for this trip, I'm probably going to pack a brand new one because this is almost out. Um, but it's just going to go in there. Um, I have my Dove Refresh Plus Care. This is my favorite dry shampoo. It's so, so, so good. I mean, I've tried a ton, you guys. Like, Orbe, I've t I've tried Batiste or whatever, and I guess other brands, but this is the only one that I really, really like. So, yeah. Um, this is my shampoo and conditioner. 
I have to grab another shampoo for my husband, like a mini one, but yeah, this is for my hair. It's for, um, it's a purple toning hair because my hair is a little bit lighter now, so I'm trying to keep it, you know, not brassy, so that's my shampoo and conditioner. And then I have here, um, my facial cleanser from Lancome. I have the toner that goes with it. I absolutely love this right here. And this is my serum. So that's all gonna go in here. And then um, this is Liam's baby body wash and shampoo. Um, here is my deodorant and my husband's. This is going to go here on the top area. And of course, a new tube of toothpaste right here. Okay, that's everything that's going to go in this section. Now, on the top part here, I'm actually going to put my perfume. This is the Jo Malone Peony and blush suede, it's just like a mini size of it. I have my Makeup Forever Mist and Fix. My eye cream, this is my favorite eye cream ever, you guys, is the one from Dior. Um, what is it called? It's the Hydra Life. It's so, so good, you guys. My favorite. It really hydrates my under eyes. It's really cooling, so it depuffs it in the morning. It's just so good. I highly recommend this. Alright, I have a lip treatment. This is Advanced Ther Therapy. It's a lip balm from Fresh. And I have the sugar scrub to go with it. My lips get really dry a lot, so that's why I'm packing these, especially from the plane ride. I'm definitely going to need this afterwards. And then I have in here, this is a little container for my It Cosmetics Neck Cream. Oh my gosh, I love this neck cream. I use it every single day, you guys. And it's orange like that. And it actually smells like oranges. I absolutely love it. Definitely check it out if you haven't. So that's that. Now into this area. I'm going to be placing this guy. This is the... Um, baby Gannick's foaming dish and bottle soap for my son so I can wash his baby bottles and toys and things like that. So there we go. Um, let's see, I have here a little container. This is actually like a soap container, but in here I have packed um, panty liners. I always wear panty liners. I don't know, this just became a hot. It just became a habit after having Liam, so now I have a bunch in here, and I like that it's in a container instead of just like floating around. Um, let's see, I have this. This is a little, you know like when you give your baby a bath, you use a sponge? I actually use the silicone to um, give him a bath and like, you know, scrub his skin and stuff like that. It's really nice and gentle, and yeah, we've been using this kind of kind of I guess sponge as you would call it on Liam since he was born so yeah I'm packing one with me I'll link it below when you buy it it comes in the pack of two so that's great um, I have here q-tips and then we have this little thing just full of um, floss and toothpicks my husband loves that um, I have here a Ziploc full of cotton pads. Shiseido cotton pads are the best, you guys, so that's what's in here. Okay, I have my razor, um, toothbrushes, my husband's, and mine. I have a clip for my hair and also a tie to go. And then this is for my hair whenever I'm not washing it because I don't wash my hair every day, so. I need that. And it all just fits in here. Well, I made it fit earlier. Let's see if I can do it again. Oh, there we go. So that is a toiletry, you guys. All right, love.
loves, that wraps up this video. That is everything I'm packing for this trip for my toiletry and makeup. I hope you all enjoyed this. Again, I will try and list and link everything in the description box down below. If you have any other questions, feel free to leave it in the comments down below and I'll make sure to answer it. Love you guys so much. Thank you for watching and I will see you all soon in my next video.